our channel. In this video, let us write Python code for lead code 556 that is next greater element. Given a positive integer n, we have to find the smallest integer which has exactly the same digits as an integer n and is greater in value than n. So, consider an input of 132465 and the expected output which is the next greater element with the same digit is 132546. So, before writing the Python code, let us understand the algorithm or the steps to execute this program to find the next greater element with the same digits. We will have a simple four steps. The first step is to Start from the rightmost digit and find the first digit which is smaller than the digits next to it. So, for the input 132465, 6 is not smaller than 5. Remember, we are starting from rightmost. But 4 is less than 6. That is the first digit which is smaller than the digits next to it. It is the outcome of step 1 is identified the position of 4. Now, the step 2 is consider all the digits to the right of the digit found in step 1. Here, to the right of the digit found in step 1 are 6 and 5. Among 6 and 5, we have to find the smallest digit among them. So, for 1, 3, 2, 4, 6, 5, the rightmost digits of step 1 are 6 and 5. Among 6 and 5, 5 is the smallest digit among them. So, the result of step 2 is we have identified the digit 5. Step 3 is swap the digits found in step 2 and 1. In step 1, we have found the first digit from right which is smaller than the digit uh, the digit next to it. In step 2, we found the smallest digit to the right of the digits in step 1. So, 4 and 5 are swapped in step 3. And the last and the fourth step is to sort the digit after the index found in step 1. See, it is the index found in step 1, not the value. So, index of 4. 4 is the smaller than the digit next to it starting from right. So, now the index and that index we have the digit 5 after step 3. So, we have to sort the digits after that. That means 6, 4 becomes 4 and 6 which is the resulting output 1, 3, 2, 5, 4, 6 for the provided input of 1, 3, 2, 4, 6, 5. Now, with these four steps, let us proceed to implement the Python program. Let us declare array which takes the input as 132465. Let us first convert this uh, number to a list by using the method list with map integer of array. And let us print the array and see if it is getting converted into the list. Uh, as we can see, the number 132465 is stored in the list called array, which has the element, six elements of 132465. So, now we will pass this list array to a function called next greater element. This next greater element is a function which will do the four steps that we have seen in our algorithm. Most of these uh, steps are very simple, either one or two lines of Python codes. Hence, it is an easy algorithm. So, coming to this uh, function, define a next greater element. First, let us get the length of this digits. Here we have given 6 digits and we got the expected result. First step is now starting from the rightmost, find the first digit which is smaller than the digit next to it. 
since we have to start from the rightmost and find the first digit which is smaller than the digit next to it, let us open a for loop starting from the rightmost. As the length is n, the rightmost shall be n minus 1 because list index starts from 0. So, the last element will be n minus 1 up to minus 1 because range excludes the n number. So, minus 1 and decrement it. Now, here is the catch. We have to find the first element which is smaller than the digit next to it. So, if digit of i is less than digit of i plus 1 because this i has to be less than the digit next to it. So, to accommodate i plus 1 which should not exceed n minus 1, we will start i for i in the range of n minus 2. That way, if digit of i is less than digit of i plus 1 that is smaller than the digit to its right which is i plus 1. We will break the loop and we will print what is the value at the step 1. So, we got 4 because 6 is not smaller than 5 whereas 4 is smaller than 6. So, 4 is the resultant element from the list digits. So, we have completed step 1 which is very easy. Now, coming to step 2. Step 2 is to consider all the digits to the right of step 1. And from this digits, we have to find the smallest digit among them. So, again, we shall have a for loop which will execute after the digit that we have found in step 1. So, for j in range of n minus 1, we will do from rightmost up to i because i is the result that we got from step 1 which has the index of our element in list. If digit of i is less than digit of j. This is we are directly checking for the greater number because when we do in the first step we are actually seeing it in the ascending order. So, if digit of i is less than digit of j we can Break the loop and the resultant outcome is 5 as expected because 6 is greater than 5. Now, we have to swap the results of step 1 and 2 for step 3 which is an one line statement uh, because in Python we can directly swap these values between the variables. So, digits of i comma digits of j which are the list elements to be swapped. So, digit of i will take a value of digit of j and digits of j gets the value of digits of i. So, now proceed to the last step that is step 4 where we have to sort the digits to the right of the index that we found in step 1. So, until index that we have till step 1, it will be same value. So, I after i plus 1, it shall be sorted. Instead of sorting, we will use the method reversed because in step 1 itself, when we read from uh, rightmost, we were reading it having it the lowest value at the right side yeah. So, we will reverse the values after the index that we have found in step 1. Now, we will see what is the outcome by uh, printing it to the terminal. So, let us print the list digits and the result is 132546 which is the list with the elements which is the next greater element with the same digits for the input 132465. 
but now instead of having it uh, uh, as a list let us convert back into the number so initialize x equal to 0 for k in range of n where n is the length of the digits we will take the uh, digit or each element multiply by 10 that means push it one step to the left and add it to the unit digits so this we will do it until length n and print the value of x which has 1 3 2 5 4 6 which is the next smaller element with the same digits for the provided input of 1 3 2 4 6 5. So we will give one more input instead of 6 digits uh, let me give 7 digits as 5 3 2 4 6 5 9 the length of this is uh, 7 digits with the same four steps we will execute it and see the resultant output the resultant output which is the next greater element with the same digit is 5324695 as expected so this is the uh, complete walkthrough of python code hope you like the video uh, please subscribe to our channel if you have not already subscribed and also like the video please share with your friends